Robert Durst was a very rich man, but he never worked a day in his life. Daddy was a billionaire who never much cared for his wife. One evening opened the window, gave his wife a little shove. Robert stood on the balcony, watched his mom fall from above. She's better off dead. Yes, she's better off dead. High-rise boy got all grown up, had to find himself a mate. He demeaned her and abused her and she left him alone, became a doctor to escape her fate. Late one night she disappeared, nobody would believe her. That psychopathic, narcissistic son of a bitch became a true deceiver. Oh, he's better off dead. Yes, he's better off dead. He's better off dead. Better off dead. All his friends would sure agree. Don't deserve no sympathy. Oh, better off dead. Yes, he's better off dead. So many more that I could name should join his company. He'd be better off dead. Yes, better off dead. Money buys you freedom, but it can't buy you peace of mind. One minute you think you're leading the pack, turn around, you're lagging behind. Better keep your mouth shut, don't tell nobody what you've done. Think you got the situation there in your hand, you might be wearing a microphone. Oh, you're better off dead. Yes, you're better off dead. Oh, he's better off dead. Yes, he's better off dead. All his friends could sure agree. Don't deserve no sympathy. Better off dead. He's better off dead. So many more that I could name should join his company. They'd be better off dead. They'd be better off dead. Charles Whitman, he hit the mark. Why Mark? That's his middle name. Climbed into the tower and plucked them off like he's playing duck hunter games. Something deep inside of him broke. He killed his wife and then a mother. August day 1966, he killed oh so many others. Oh, he's better off dead. Yes, he's better off dead. 